hard to take your eyes off of this video. Look at that. An electrical fire just terrified people north of Atlanta. Investigators in Cobb County say these flames you're seeing here sparked at a substation for an electricity provider. It was loud. It was bright. Atlanta News First reporter Rebecca Stram has been on scene since earlier this morning, and she is just south of Marietta where this is happening along County Services Parkway. Rebecca, when that happened, neighbors didn't know what was going on. You're exactly right, Lana. You know, if you've never seen a transformer blow, it can be pretty frightening. Well, imagine a substation on fire. That's exactly what happened here. We just left or uh, watched some of the workers from Cobb EMC leave here. They've been trying to figure out how this happened. Was it weather related? Did that overnight rain somehow get into a component and cause problems? They're not saying just yet, but one thing's for sure, that fire caused some nearby residents to panic. I mean, entire sky is lit up. Some who live within a few hundred yards of Cobb EMC's substation number eight had never seen anything like it. I don't know, it might be a bomb. Amy Barnes started recording video, not knowing what was happening, just that it looked like nonstop colorful lightning in the sky and there were explosions. It was the most terrifying sight that I had ever seen in my life. It grew bigger and bigger and brighter, and people started grabbing their dogs and their kids, throwing them in their cars and fleeing. Haley Romero and her aunt took videos on their phones, too. It was horrible. Like, um, I got so scared. It went pitch black. We still had a little bit of uh, power, but then, like, seconds later, like, everything. Just no power anywhere. Turned out it was an electrical fire that Cobb County firefighters couldn't put out until they got the all clear from the power company. At daylight, we saw workers from Cobb EMC return to the substation where the fire originated. A spokesman for the utility cooperative told me workers acted quickly overnight and that all customers serviced through that substation had their power rerouted and restored by 2 a.m. And so far, Cobb ENC can only say it was an equipment failure that caused this. We'll let you know what more they learn. Live near Marietta, Rebecca Schramm, Atlanta News First.